We're continuing to follow the, the death of a one-year-old. It happened about 11 this morning. Police say two dogs mauled the child in his front yard in a neighborhood near Fowler and Jensen. Those dogs will be euthanized. Our Dennis Valera joining us live at the Central California SPCA. And Dennis, how did those dogs get loose? Stephanie, we're told the dogs dug out from under a fence. Now, animal control officers found the owners after searching the neighborhood for hours. When found, the owners relinquished custody of the dogs. Now, talking with neighbors there, they tell me that loose dogs, they are a problem in the neighborhood, but authorities, they couldn't confirm that with me so far. In their kennels, these two Rottweilers seem calm. A red quarantine tag, the only hint of the horrors authorities say they did. Police say this quiet street turned into a crime scene when a one-year-old child wandered outside of his home. The dogs, walking loose in the neighborhood, attacked the child in his front yard. His grandparents tried to save him. She tried to get the dogs off of the one-year-old. She was also bit. Uh, it took the grandfather, who was also in the house, to get out and use a hose on these dogs to get the dogs off the one-year-old. With the help of animal control officers, the dogs were found and taken to the stray animal kennels. Some neighbors I spoke to say they've run into loose or stray dogs in the neighborhood before, but this is a first for the dogs in this case. We don't have any past history with them, and uh, we did check all our database, so there is nothing at that location. Um, but it, they did seem to want to get out of that backyard where they were located at. Lieutenant Mark Hudson with Fresno Police says this is the important takeaway from this tragedy. Just always be watching your children, you know, never take your eyes off of them, uh, never let them out of your sight. Now, the dogs, they did not have microchips in them, and the SPCA is telling me that there were no issues with the owners giving up custody of the dogs. Live here at Central California SPCA, Dennis Valera, KC24 Local News That Matters.